That doesn't sound good at all. Like, is something going to blow up or... Is there something going to fall on us? Like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what that noise was. That was bad. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to the channel. We're back at it with more Into the Flames gameplay. We're back on Canton County once again, Station 4. We're going to be doing some more new fires here today. A few that I have found that we have yet to cover. And uh, we've also got another update to the game that came out on the 20th. Uh, it looks like it's basically just a few uh, bug fixes. It's kind of a small update, but uh, an um update. Nonetheless, uh, let's see, bug fixes, uh, yeah, just some little small things here, cosmetic things, stuff like that. Uh, helmets added, uh, helmet accessories to the New York style helmet, so you can kind of see it on the side there. I don't know what those deals are. It looks like maybe a wedge, and I don't know what the other thing is. Uh, let me know in the comments what they uh, wear on their helmets. Uh, text chat, disable chat filter for uh, bad words, certain words being blocked. Uh, added a chat history, uh, pressing enter while chat box is open. With no text now closes it and uh, move chat text up so it can't uh, be blocked by HUD element. So that's cool. And then uh, the big thing uh, is that he swapped uh, Rescue 2 out with uh, Rescue 1 here at Station 4. Uh, we still have Rescue 2. We still have it. I mean, you can put it here if you want to, but uh, it's gone now. And he also took the brush truck off as well, too. So uh, you can spawn them back in, but just uh, frees up some slots and uh, it gives a little different... Uh, Look, so very cool. All right, we need to um, do a few things first before we get started. I want to get rid of the squad. Uh, since we already have a rescue unit here, I'm going to get rid of the squad and spawn an engine in. So we're going to go to fire stations. Uh, which one is it? Uh, uh, 4B. Okay, there we go. Remove truck. And we'll hit squad. We'll get rid of him. And then we'll go back and add... An engine. Let's do um, let's do engine two. We hardly ever do that one. We hardly ever do that one. So let's do engine two. Three is by far my favorite. Three looks really nice. I think it's uh, it, it's it seems like a little bit more of an updated model. Like they have more details and stuff like that uh, invested in three. But uh, two is really nice as well. Two is a little different. So let's take him. And first, let's turn this down just a tad. Uh, let's take him and park him in the station, and then we'll get going on some calls here. There we go. Very nice. All right, let's kill the engine by hitting R, and we'll hop out by hitting E. Get this door open as well here, if it'll do it. There we go. All right, now for calls, let's go to my list here. Let's see. All right, I got one particular call in mind that we're going to be hitting... Today. Let's hit tab. Let's go to emergencies and it's going to be to Ralph Avenue is the call that I'm looking for. It is one I have yet to do. I've been trying to go through this list and pick out calls that we have not uh, have not done yet or have not seen. So there we go to Ralph Avenue and we'll exit out of that. And it's going to be right here at us. Wow. Okay. <laughs> it's like literally right around the corner. We still need to take the helicopter out. I, I'm going to jump in the helicopter one day and kind of play around with it and figure it out and then maybe we can do a video with it i'm not exactly sure what all you would do with a helicopter to be honest but uh either way there's our fire some kind of structure over there and it is well involved so let's get heading that way in fact i want to freeze the time let's do that as well too let's go to host options game time normal paused um i think we're good with all that let's hit return and we're set so we got the time pause late evening here Time moves so fast in this game. It, it really does. It moves fast. It, at times, I almost kind of wish it was slowed down a little bit or if we had like a uh, time scale or something that we could um, adjust it with. But, uh, you know, it, it moves really quick either way. All right, let's get the lights going. There we go. All right, let's head that way. I was talking about uh, the different sirens the other day. I guess it was in the last video, and I said, you know, I'm not a siren guy. I don't know that much about him. And you guys always step up to the plate and tell us, you know, exactly what kind of siren it is and all that stuff. So I do appreciate that. Pretty cool. Uh, what do we got here? Uh, it looks like it's going to be a service station, right? Let's kill that. 
We need uh we need a hydrant. Bad. We need a hydrant. Let's hold tight here for a second. Uh it's around the other corner actually. Let's do that. Being a gas station, this is my line of thought is that you wouldn't wait for a second dude to get your supply because this seems like kind of a volatile situation. So maybe first dude would go ahead and lay in. And then uh you know that way they can have water right off the bat i mean it's already well involved it's not like you're going to be saving anything other than the gas tanks like you might be saving the gas tanks but grab the supply line and let's uh let's hook you up if you let me i was gonna say they better let me we'll be in trouble if it doesn't we we'll have to come up with some more water tools hydrant wrench I do. I love the logistics. The logistics are just so much fun to me. I, I don't know why. I don't know why, but I love the water logistics of this game. I mean, like I said before, I like logistics in uh, in any game, but um, water logistics are really cool. All right, man, it is going good, right? All right, let's, uh, let's stop here and let's hop out. All right, I think we're good on our supply. Let's grab uh, equipment, gear, air pack. Exit out of you. I'm wondering, on a service station fire like this, would you uh, do anything to protect the pumps? Would you do anything to protect the gas pumps, or is it not a worry? Like, to me, that's kind of a concern. But as I've said a bazillion times, I'm no expert. I'm no expert whatsoever, so I don't know. But you know what? Just for... Uh, just for fun, we're going to put a little water out there. We'll put a little water on them. I don't know. I don't know if they do that in real life, but this is what we're doing. All right, let's uh, <laughs> we'll exit out. We'll put a little water on it. Yeah, the stream is kind of uh, kind of weird there. A little bit. Uh, let's get some more equipment here. Like We need some more stuff, I think. This is fully involved. We're not going to be making an interior attack. Actually, let's do our 360 first. Who we got here. Uh, so we got a lot of cars here on the scene. And uh, we got an open door here in the rear. Maybe some people got out. At least I hope so. I don't think there's any reports of people trapped. I'm most definitely not going up in there, though. That's pretty bad. Oh, we got a fuel tank on the side here, too. Uh, that is definitely something we need. I think that's more of a concern than the... Um, then the gas pumps. Let's see. How could we... I don't want to park the truck between um, the fuel tank and the uh, gas pump. So, like, I think that's like a recipe for disaster, right? Okay. Uh, let's kill that, and let's jump on some more equipment. We'll bring some more stuff here. I think it's going to be kind of a big response. Uh, let's go to tab. Emergencies. Let's do... Uh, we didn't take that. And let's establish command. And I think we're good with all that for now. Let's upgrade the alarm. Let's do uh, let's do a second alarm because there's so many cars and stuff like that in the parking lot. Someone made that uh, point in another video. Said, um, you know, sometimes basically the way I read into it was it's not necessarily the structure, but like potential problems around the structure as well too. So this seems like there's a lot of vehicles here. All right, more vehicles. We need more equipment. Let's go to fire stations. Or a let's do. Um, oh, I kind of wish I had the squad now because we could have used it as another uh, <laughs> as another engine. We kind of goofed up on that maybe for this fire. It'd be all right though. Let's do the tiller. Let's bring the tiller here. We do have a slot for another piece of equipment. We could bring if we wanted to, but all right. Let's hit F. Let's hit H and L for the lights, and we'll get rolling. They're steered out there. There we go. This is all keyboard and mouse, of course. This is all keyboard and mouse. I'd love to be able to use my wheel on this. Uh, the wheel makes it uh, really nice, but maybe one of these days. Either way, they are constantly, constantly working on this game. I just find that really cool. I'm like getting lots and lots of updates. Um, Let's park this guy on the street. Let's park him right here. And... Uh, yeah, I think that'll be good right there, kind of on the corner. Let's hop out. 
And let's deploy the outriggers. There we go. And we're going to need a water supply for this guy as well, too. We're going to need a lot more equipment here. What's our hydrant situation look like? Let's see. We've got one a little bit down the street and then another one down and around the corner. So we've got those two that we could use as well. We could run from the engine if we need. Let's see. What else do we got as far as stations? I think station five would be a good one to call out to. And we got station one too. So yeah, let's do one and five would be really good. Those fire stations five, uh, teleport to... Let's take engine two. I think we're going to need him ASAP. There we go. All right, get headlight, lights. All right, let's get headed that way. I should do the other side. There we go. Yeah, right, we'll do that one. We'll go with that. Yeah, I think what we'll do is we'll just swing the block. We'll go down there and grab that other hydrant, and then we'll lay into uh, up there around the tiller ladder, and we should be good. Uh, we could use the deck gun from this one to uh, spray that tank over there. That might be good as well. Uh, let's see. How can we do this? This is going to be... Yeah, it's going to be a one-way. Um... Let's go down. Yeah, let's go down. Let's go down and grab this hydrant here. We'll just circle back around. There we go. All right, let's hop out. Let's do it. Grab our supply line. There we go. And let's get our hydrant wrench. Got him as well. And then we'll switch to our wrench and use E. And now we got our supply going. Sweet. Okay. All right. Let's lay in up here to the tiller. Let's see. How could we do this? I just, I don't want to get around the pumps too much. I just feel like that could be a big issue. Let's do this. Let's go right here like so. And let's hop out. And we'll do this deck gun as well. All right, let's raise you up with R. I don't know if that's hitting it or not. It's always so hard to judge the uh, the deck guns. Where are your streams going at? Yeah, yeah, it's kind of flipping out. I can't tell. I can't tell. That's good enough. I think we're fine with that. All right, we've got uh, outriggers are down on this. Let's do a supply to that engine and it will be good. All right, there we go. Discharge is set. Uh, use ladder, operate ladder. Yeah, it doesn't look like our deck gun's really doing much there. Let's, uh, let's cool that tank down with this. We'll do it with this. Let's see. Let's go up to the top. Uh, I don't think we need to go up anymore. Let's go out if we can. Well, it looks like, I mean, I consider that like, uh, that is the tank that we fill our uh, equipment up with. So I kind of consider that like a tank of uh, diesel. So I guess it's not like the worst. There we go. All right, let's hop back down and let's exit that. All right, let's see what that looks like. Yeah, they keep flipping out for some reason. I don't know why they're doing that. It's only you look at it at certain angles and they don't. There we go. That's much better. That's at least kind of reaching it. Let's kill this deck gun. Let's kill him. There we go. All right, let's hop back down. 
Uh, what else can we bring to the scene? Um, I think rescue needs to come as well, too. Like, we could bring him. We need to bring the other ladder from uh, Station 5. Actually, let's grab him first, because we could actually use him. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Let's get out of you. Go back to Fire Station, Station 5. Ladder 1. Got ladder. Ladder 1. Alright, we'll do that. We'll bring this from Station 5. We'll bring the equipment from Station 1. And we'll bring Rescue. And I think that should be it. Like, We'll have a ton of stuff there. This is literally like right down the street. It's not very far at all. Alright, let's see. What do we want to do with this guy? Let's go on the other side here. I think this would be a good spot. There we go. Alright, let's get him set up. We'll use him for our aerial attack as well. His ladder, do outriggers. Sweet. Operate ladder. This guy up and over. Alright, let's check out the top. And we'll go out just a bit. Nice. That should be good. All right. Let's go back down. We'll exit and grab our supply line. Oop, come on. Let's grab it. And we'll go down to the engine here and we'll tie in the helm. And we should be good. Like, we'll have one other engine on scene, so. All right, let's do that. And, man, that looks good, right? I see. That thing is well involved. Like, it's really good. I love the big fires. All right, let's go to the fire station, station one. Uh, engine three. All right, it's going to be engine three. Out of station one, it's going to be engine model type. When I say engine three, it just means the type, the like the visual. They're always going to be numbered for that particular station that they roll out of. But uh, like I said, the visual is going to be for the engine three style. So, uh, which way do we need to go? Back around this way, right? There we go. Yeah. All right. Engine 3 is definitely my favorite. Favorite. It is a really, really nice, uh, nice looking engine there. Well detailed. Looks good. Uh, I was thinking, do we need to tie into another hydrant? I don't think we do. I, I don't think we do. I think we're all right, but. Dude, where could we take this guy? We could take him around on the other side here if we wanted. We could. What we could do actually is run a supply from this one to uh, the other engine and then... Yeah, let's do that instead. Let's do that instead. We're going to change this up just a little bit here. I don't know how well this is going to work out. We'll see. Let's take this guy and we'll drop him right here. Now we'll grab supply from this guy and run him over to the other engine. It's starting to look like a fire scene with all the supply lines laying around everywhere, right? <laughs> it's like there's a ton of them. All right, there we go. We got that one, and we'll get one more here. Uh, pick it back up with E, that's right. Yeah, sometimes, like, when you drop your attack line on the ground, you can just pick it up by, um, I forgot where I was going. Pick it up by uh, just left-clicking on it, but uh, when you drop these supply lines like that, you have to pick them up with E, so definitely it took me a minute to figure that out. 
There we go. Now we're good. Now we're good. Um, let's go ahead and get this guy going. Oh, come on. I want to work for me. Why can't I get... There we go. Uh, operate ladder. Go up top side. Let's... Go ahead and get our nozzle. Oh, I gotta lock it. Never mind. Gotta lock it first. Uh, let's hit J. We'll uh, toggle the water pipe. Now we got control of it. And we can give it some water here. There we go. Alright, now back down to the ground. And I think we said we're gonna bring one more, right? So we got three engines. Two ladders. Uh, let's bring the aerial too. Let, I mean, not there. Let's bring the tower ladder as well too. He can be our, uh, our RIT. We'll bring him. Fire station, station one, uh, tower ladder. Let's get him. Do all the things. Oh, these things are a beast. They really just are. Couldn't imagine, I, I couldn't even begin to imagine driving one of these things. What did that say back here? Welcome to paradise. I still need to do the station tour. Someone ask about the equipment and station tour for uh, Into the Flames. So we need to do that. We might just do a short little video one day where we just look at all the equipment and the stations. But... There we go. Nice. All right. Um, where do we want to put this guy? I think right over here, maybe. I think right here is about as good as any. All right, and then our last piece is going to be rescue. We'll bring him. He's going to be on 4B. There we go. Oh, it didn't let me teleport because I am in the engine. You have to exit it to teleport. Definitely want to remember that. Uh, 4B rescue. Yeah, so, uh, you know, before we've been running the old Mac, where they call it the old quack rescue unit here but uh it's been swapped out i guess it's been retired for heavy rescue rescue one now we can bring the mac back if we want to sometime it's like it's not a big deal and you have whichever one you want i'm still looking forward to a lot of old school stuff i, I want to see more old school stuff i think that would be so awesome and it seems like a lot of people kind of share the same opinion too so that's cool All right, let's see. Where can we throw this guy? We'll put him back behind the, the tiller ladder. Nice. Okay, so we've got a nice little scene going on here. Do we not? Like, this looks pretty damn awesome, right? Look at that. Just have to kind of uh, stand back and take it all in, right? <laughs> it looks really good. I like that. Man, I'm trying to find me some screenshots here. Y'all just go out to bear with me. All right, there we go. Got a few screenshots, so we're set with that. Let's go ahead and uh, let's set up RIT before we get too far involved with this because I, I forget and then I go in and then I die and then I'm screwed. So we need to get RIT going here. Uh, exit out of this. Let's go back to command mode. There we go. There's our drone. And let's get up. Let's see. So we're doing this as a second alarm. I think this is okay. It might be overkill. Like, it just depends. We got a lot of cars and there is fuel. So I think a second alarm is all right for that. Um, AI menu. What do we want to do? We want to do uh, firefighter rescue team. There we go. Let's put these guys up. We'll put them over here by the... Uh, power ladder there we go and what else do we want uh, you know we might could honestly do a hazmat team because this is a gas station like I, that doesn't honestly seem like out of the realm of possibility for me so let's do that let's do these guys let's do uh hazardous material team and we'll do them right here and we could do maybe the tent I, you know, I don't know. We could do all the things, maybe. I think we're good with this right now. Let's just stick with this. We won't go too crazy with it. And primary search. 
Let's do that as well. There we go. Very nice. That is a cool scene. I wish I could get a screenshot from the drone camera. You can't get the HUD down though. I thought you could. I thought you could, but you can't. But that would be very cool if we could. Looks good, right? Like that is a good looking scene. This is one of the uh, bigger responses that I think we've had. So we got uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven units. That's not bad. Not bad at all. All right. Uh, how do we want to attack this? I think purely exterior attack. I think purely exterior is the way to go. Let's uh, exit out of this. There we go. Question is, do we want our buddies to do it for us or do we want to do this? I I kind of want to do it myself a little bit starting out, I'll be honest, I kind of do. They if we put our buddies on it, they're going to knock they're going to knock it out really quick. I want this to go for a bit. So let's grab an attack line. And let's just go to the front here and we'll start hitting it. Nice. Alright, so there we go. Man, this place is going really good. Why did it stop? Uh, I don't know. They keep stopping on me. Surely we got water, right? Hang on. Let's hold tight here for a second. We control. Let's drop you down right here. And let's look at our water situation here. Surely we've got water. No, we don't. Why do we not have water? Did, they, did we not turn this on? Yeah, we did. So why do we not have water? I'm at a loss. Um, is it? He's got water. Like, no, he's coming off. Wait, the other engine is coming off of this engine. And then they're going to the tower ladder. The not tower ladder. The ladder with that one. So where's our water going? I don't understand. We got a water situation here. Um, I got too many lines. Like, they're literally everywhere. I don't know. Let's try this. This is a good hydrant, right? Like, I know sometimes they won't work. All right, there it's on. Look what that does. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with that. What's up with the other engine over here? Uh, he's good. He's not topped off, but he's good. So, is it because the other one is relaying to this one? Is that what it is? Like, I, I'm at a loss, guys. Y'all let me know. Uh, let me know what you think. If you play the game, let me know. All right, let's check this one out. Maybe this one will be all right. No, he is not good either. Why? What is up with these? I do not know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what's going on with them. Uh, so my question is now, can we pull an attack line off of this guy? It's almost like there's not enough water to go around. Maybe I don't know what's up with that. All right, let's try this. Not this way. Yeah, this one's better for some reason. I don't know what's going on with the other two. I really don't. I'm at a loss. I don't know if that's by design or if that's something like that's something I'm doing or if it's a bug or what, but we'll do it this way. I don't I really don't want to go in. I want to do this as like a purely exterior if we can. Oh, we'll be able to grab that one right there. It doesn't look like it. All right, let's hop up. And we'll go around the other side here. We'll use the uh, aerials in a bit to uh, work on the roof some more.
Yeah, this one is working better. I, yeah, I don't know why. Doesn't quite make sense to me what's going on with that, but either way, we're getting water now, so that's good at least. Now I just need some ground monitors. That would be cool. There we go. Alright, we got him. I think we're going to have to knock some of these windows out. Alright, let's drop you down here. And... I want to look at this again real fast. See what's going on with him. Yeah, he's empty too. Why are we not getting water? I I don't know. Something is going on big time though. You know what? Let's jump on the uh, ladder. Use E. Operate ladder and then let's go to the top. There you go. These guys have water. I don't know if it's a situation where they're like they're using the water that's available or I will get this roof knocked out and then uh, we'll turn it off and see if that helps the other trucks. I don't know what's going on with that. And this is a really persistent fire. Like, it's not. Let's do this. Let's come back over a little bit. There we go. Now we got it. Nice. All right, now we're making some headway. Yeah, we get this uh, roof taken care of. We should be good. This is the one thing that I'm kind of looking forward to in firefighting simulation is like when you have a fire like this on a roof, like it's fully involved, the roof is compromised. I would kind of consider this like the roof's not even there. Like it's just burned through it, right? So, I mean, technically at that point, you should be able to like hit everything inside, right? Like just pour water is basically just a shell. All right, there we go. Let's come back around the other way here. We'll grab this guy. Nice. Yeah, we're going to be able to get all of it. Okay, cool. Let's put you back around straight. Uh, we'll hit J again, swing you back around, and I think go down just a bit and out. There we go. Nice. All right, we're on it now. Look at that. We should be getting close to being done here. I'm wondering, is this having any effect inside? I would be curious to see. Toggle that back around. There we go. Yeah, we almost got it. Yeah, we're almost done, guys. We'll finish this roof up, and then uh, we'll go take a peek inside. Nice. All right. Let's kill you. Let's go back down and let's look at our water situation. All right, let's exit out. Yeah, I think. We've still got a water issue. I don't know why. I don't know why. I don't know what's up with that. Look at that. Got another sub rolling in. Yeah, thanks, guys. I really do appreciate it. It's been an awesome, awesome, uh, Awesome week. Like, subs have just been rolling in. Subs into views. Yeah, we're out of water. Like, we have a water issue here. I don't know why. I don't know why. Um, Let's drop you back down. Damn, do we need another hydrant? Like, I, we're tied into hydrants. We're tied into Two different hydrants, and we still have a water issue. I don't know what's going on with that. Yeah, that one too. He's just about empty. 
Uh, well, I mean, that's not to say you can't have water pressure issues and water issues and stuff like that in real life, so... Um, shoot, let's bring a tanker. Let's bring a tanker for now. We'll do that. People like tanker ops, and uh, we'll bring them. Trying to think what would be the best one. I think uh, Station 2 would be the best tanker. I don't want to bring Tanker 3, so let's take him off. Let's remove him. Let's exit, and let's bring... Uh, let's see. What do we want to bring? Spawn truck. Um, I think tanker too. I think that's good middle of the road kind of tanker to bring. All right, let's go down there to him. Station two, tanker two. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. All right, let's get headlights and lights going. <laughs> Having to bring the county trucks in. <laughs> Having to bring the rural trucks in to help. Evidently, the uh, the water system there in town is not that great, or it could be the firefighting. One of the two. Either way, we've got a water issue. Some kind of water issue going on. Hopefully, this thing is full. Yes, it is. Nice. So, this should definitely be enough for us to, um, to finish the fire up. Yeah, we'll bring him in. We'll set up a, uh, a pool. And um, we'll just use that. <laughs> he took it up on the, on the concrete barrier. That's hilarious. AI anything is always so entertaining. Like, you never know what to expect. All right, let's kill that. We don't need all that mess. We're good. And let's go back around here. Let's see, which one do we want to use? Is the question. Um, I wonder, could we set up by the hydrant down there? I, I wonder, I wonder. Um, let's do that. Let's go by the hydrant down here. Let's go right here. All right, let's exit out. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with the water. I really, I like, I'm at a loss. I don't know. Portable pond. We want to set this guy up right there. Bam, look at that. Perfect. Uh, what else? So we could run this guy. Let's see. Uh, let's, can we swap you around? No, we can't. So let's go back. Disconnect hose, and we want to go into our discharge on that, and then we want to go... Should have flip-flopped it around, actually, but that'll be all right. Grab the intake. And we'll go to that guy. We'll be filling up now. Yes, it is. Nice. All right. <laughs> and then we got to take the supply from this one. And we'll run him over here. What a hot mess. Like, <laughs> there's hoses everywhere here. It's cool, though, to see, like, what the game is going to do. Like, I've got a spaghetti network of hoses here and tons of equipment and... So now he's filled back up. Uh, this guy, what, what are we doing here? He's empty. He's not filling. We don't have water in town. Like, there's no water in town whatsoever. I don't know what's going on. It looks like our fire is just about out anyway, so. All right, let's pick you up. And... I don't think we can... What is that? That doesn't sound good at all. Like, is something going to blow up or?
Is there something going to fall on us? Like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what that noise was. That was bad. All right. You know what? I said we weren't going to do an interior attack. Well, let's do an interior attack because I, I feel like we need to get this out. Like, there's some things going on. There's some things going on in here. There we go. Oh man, it's so dark in here, right? Like you can't see Jack. I hear some fire. I hear the fires. I hear some fires in there. I just don't know. Where's it at? There it is. It's back here in his back room. That one, the bathrooms are good. What is this? Like a storage room? It looks like it. I still hear fire. Where's that coming from? Yeah, there we go. What else we got? Is that it? Maybe. Maybe we grab us an ice cream real quick before we get out of here. Alright, uh, let's drop you down and... Let's get uh, let's get a Halligan. We'll bust these windows out. I think we're good. I think it's just a smoke issue now. Uh, Halligan, there we go. Doesn't seem like. Uh, there we go. Yeah, vented. Nice. Okay. Wait, it looks like it's still got a little bit of smoke in the back there. Yeah, a little in the dumpster, too. Oh, there's fire in there, too. Man, I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> there's the dumpsters caught on fire. All right, uh, let's put this back, then. Yeah, I was totally, totally not expecting that. We got water. Are we good? How are we doing on this now? Uh, yeah, we're still good. Okay, nice. Uh, yeah, I see some weird... Like, what is up with that? Oh, it's going really good back here now. Okay, well. Get it real fast. There we go. There we go. Now it is under control. Wow. That was uh, that was quite the experience, guys. Like, man, I don't know what to think about the water. I enjoyed it, though. I like the water issue. I like having to kind of, like, plan around that and figure out a solution, but... I don't know what's going on with that. I don't know if it's something I did or if there's just something wrong or uh, if the city's having a bad day with their water supply. I, I don't know, but we definitely had some water issues. We're, we're good on that. Did this guy ever fill back up? Did he did he fill up all? He should be filling up off the hydrant. No, he's not. He's It's like we're not getting anything out of the hydrants. I don't know what's going on with that. Anyway, that's going to do it for this one, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to hit that like, subscribe, ring that bell, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know what uh, what your thoughts are on the uh, water supply issues. Is it something I did or is it uh, something bigger going on in town? Anyway, thank you so much for love and support. Love all you guys, and we'll catch you in Canton County next time. Peace.